Well, hello, B for Beers. B for Beers. B, B for Beers. Sorry about that. I just can't help but do it. Anyway, AA Ron coming at you. Uh, a lot of people have asked me my setup for my videos that you guys see when I do my micro lessons. So I thought I'd do a quick little few minutes on my setup. Now, if you know anything about me, uh, people think that I'm very efficient. I am not. I'm the laziest person I know, which means everything I do has to be done with max efficiency, okay? Literally, even my thumbnail videos take me five minutes to do. I Everything I do has to be quick, but um, there's a saying that you, everybody's heard of, done is better than perfect. I changed that 20, 25 years ago. Done well is better than perfect. I've seen some done stuff and I'm like, do I'd rather you just wait. Done well is better than perfect. Um, I think Mark Cuban said it actually years ago, Perfection is the um, opposite of profit or the enemy of profit. Perfection is the enemy of profit. <clears throat> and it is. So um, I wanted to kind of give you guys a little quick little headshot, I guess, a little sneak peek. Wizard of Oz, one of my favorite movies. Uh, peel back that curtain and show you what the wizard does to do the videos. And so to do that, I um, wanted to first let you know I do the videos, I record them on my S22 Ultra which I just use the native camera app. I have open camera as an app, but and I've even got it configured the way everybody says to do it. But I don't know, I feel like my S22 Ultra camera does well. Uh, my mic, you guys see I have a mic. My Hollyland Max, I think they call it, Hollyland Max, I believe. Anyway, these things are bad to the bone. So you just plug and play in it and it's ready to roll. So those two things are crucial. Now, I'll tell you how I hold the phone is with my Ulanzi tripod. Oh my God, dude. This thing, and especially this little top piece because you can do your phone long way. And the thing that I like about it is when I put my phone in this, it's so thin, it does not interfere with the S22 camera. And you know that camera has like five lenses on it. So it's like one fourth of the back of the phone is giant. It's just lenses it doesn't interfere at all which is really cool but i like it because it's like pow pow extend put it back in clip clip i mean it is the greatest tripod i have ever had the joy of using and again everything for me has to be quick so when i get to the gym or i'm setting up it has to take me just a couple minutes to set up now <clears throat> let me show you my secret sauce i have a clip so on the back so I always have the phone flipped the other way, never facing me where I see, it's always the other way where it's the good cameras. The problem is you can't see the screen, right? Well, I found on Amazon a really cool little document holder. Like it's, it's, it's like, a, like an arm and it's got two clips on both ends like this, bleak. So they both open up, this one opens up and I clip it on the Ulanzi like tripod. And then this one, I, I can, and it's also moving. I move it up and I clip in a mirror. This mirror right here, it's like a shower mirror. I got an Amazon for like, first of all, I'm the cheapest human alive. So it always has to be like uber cheap. And so, oh my gosh, I haven't even peeled off. Oh my gosh. This is like, oh, oh, I didn't even know that was on there. Oh my gosh. Plastic. Peace out. There's a trash can back there somewhere. So anyway, on my phone, I have this little clip and this. So as I'm doing the video, I can see myself to make sure that I'm in frame. And more importantly, I don't know why. Every once in a while, this phone stops recording on its own. I don't get it, okay? And you can tell because it has like a little red recording bar across the top. On my mirror, I see my, oh my gosh. You can see my screen right now. Oh, that's what I see. Except what you're seeing up here is like my Amazon wish list. Not wish list, stuff that I bought for the bike ride. Anyway, this thing is like this, and so I can see what I'm seeing, right? So those are really, it. oh, and my notes. I am petrified of showing up unprepared, so I never, ever, ever do a B for B micro lesson without notes. Uh, sometimes the content is uh, so fresh, I don't actually have to print it, but I always prep 100%. I'm just a guy that has a major phobia of not being prepared or unprepared, not being prepared, or showing up unprepared. Um, and these were the notes from uh, this morning's micro lesson on required minimum distributions. And uh, as long as you, a lot of you guys know, I've been a retirement planner, um, really kind of specialized in accounting for 
uh, 20, over 20 years. I'm going on 25 years. I uh, started in 02. So um, it's been quite a, a while. But anyway, there's some notes for today's micro lesson. That's it. That's how I record every single uh, micro lesson, whether I'm at the gym. If I'm in an office, depending on the office, uh, in my very first couple videos that I did before I needed to start training at the same time, I was um, in an office and the office I was in has a motion sensor. So I'd be recording a micro lesson and the lights would go off. So when I'm in an office, I add one additional element to that and that is a rotating fan. <laughs> <laughs> it just creates enough motion to keep the lights from turning off on me. You don't know how embarrassing that is doing a micro lesson and psh, it goes dark. So uh, luckily it's not dark right now. The sun's coming up. I just finished my um, uh, workout at the gym, got my cardio done and it's a full day of meetings. And then I've got my flying lesson this afternoon. So it's going to be a full day. Hope that that gave you guys some ideas, some motivation, the diving board to jump off to to kind of pursue your own dreams if you will so anyway want to get you guys that update and uh you guys know what time it is it's time to get to work i'll see you guys later